Hello, Toronto. It is TMI time. Toronto Market Insights, of course. And here are the June stats. Compared to last year, sales increased by a whopping 17%. New listings were down by 3% and total inventory has been depleted by 12%, making for a very tight and competitive market. Average sale prices rose by 3% to just under 1.2 million. And on average, everything sold in just 14 days, very quickly. Condo sales soared by 27%, with prices declining by 1% to $740,000. But what stunned me was the sales of detached homes in the GTA. In 416, a mere 807 homes were sold, but in the 905, 2,750, 400% more than in the city. And if that isn't very enthusiastic supply and demand, I don't know what is. And meanwhile, supply in the city is at crisis levels still. The good news, a resilient economy, tight labor market and record population growth kept sales above last year's lows. The bad news, short supply and unaffordability, which is being further hampered by taxes and fees associated with new construction and housing sales. The average price for a detached home in Toronto today, $1.8 million. For a house costing just $1.1 million, to get a five-year fixed mortgage with a down payment of 20% and including heat and property taxes, you will need a gross household income of $340,000 to qualify at the stress test level. What's worse, we just woke up this morning to yet another rate hike. These hikes have not yet discouraged consumers from buying uh, big ticket items like cars and homes. So let's see if July st uh, stats will show a slowdown other than our normal seasonal slowdown. That's it for today. Stay tuned for my August TMI, where I will be back again with the good news and the bad news on Toronto's housing market. Thanks so much for listening. See you soon.